it's always a red letter day when the All Blacks come to town. Um, and also the fact that they are the current world champions at the moment makes it um, a little bit more special. Um, I think whenever a team are the world champions, you know, with South Africa before and going back to England in 2003, you know, for that period it, it is a special um, fixture when you actually get them coming to, uh, you know, to, to your home ground. They, they have a way of playing the game and uh, obviously they're outstandingly good at that. And uh, whichever 10th, uh, you know, is playing in that pivotal position, you know, he will bring his own talent to that position and, and his own variances. You know, we're, we're pretty happy with our fitness levels at the, the Sada Hat, that super rugby, rugby championship level. Um, they've worked very, very hard over the last couple of weeks and uh, we've, we've eased off this week. We've gone back to our normal training sessions where, you know, obviously rugby's a priority. Yeah. All I can say is, you know, we have all the, the utmost respect for, for Rich McCaw. He's, um, he's, um, he epitomises the All Black team because he's, he's um, He's a very, very competitive player and uh, he's, he's also very, very aggressive. Obviously, Sonny Bill's a, an outstanding player. Uh, he, he can promote the ball at the tackle, as everybody knows, and uh, he's not the only one. I mean, there's a number of players in the All Blacks team who can promote the ball at the tackle. So it's important that, number one, that initial tackle is strong, and uh, number two is that you know we make sure we trail the offload and uh, the support players. Well, we have to, try, we have to attempt to keep the ball against them. Um, I think there's a lot of tries being scored in World Rugby at the moment. You know, generally, um, you know, if you look at the Super, uh, sorry, the Rugby Championship games, which were played in the dry, dry conditions, obviously in the wet conditions, they were much tighter. Uh, there's a lot of tries being scored at the moment. You know, two, three tries in, in, in being conceded by most teams around the world. You know, uh, b because the attacks are so good. Uh, you know, th there's a real emphasis by the referees to make the tackler roll away at the moment. And so that obviously leads to you know more attacking play, and you'd be able to keep the ball for uh, for longer, more sustained periods. Uh, yeah, he's a bit, he's a huge threat. as Julian is uh, he's definitely one of the outstanding wingers in world rugby. Is um, you can see the guy's developed. He's, he's a tremendous athlete. You know, he's got great feet and power for, for for a big man. But he's also you know he's, he's he's developing into an outstanding rugby player as well. So definitely the last time we played the All Blacks, um, which was a couple of years ago, um, I think we're in better shape than we was then. Um, but Julian Surveyor was a big reason that they, um, you know, they were dominant that day.